Hi, my name is Justin Blakely from Investigative Training, bringing you another battle of the camcorders. I'm pitting three camcorders up against each other. One is the Allura 100. It's a Mini DV standard definition camcorder with a digital stabilizer, a Panasonic TM55 a 1080 HD model, and it has a, an optical stabilizer and a Sony CX7 1080 HD and it is a digital stabilizer here I'm doing a long distance test the wind is blowing our cameras around a little bit so this is not a stability test this is a long distance test and you can uh, see and determine the detail for yourself the Panasonic is far more saturated in color um, the Allure 100 is very noisy at that level because I believe that's slightly into digital zoom there here we have the stabilizer test. My arms are locked down uh, by the elbows on a surface, and that is it. So it'll zoom in here, and you can look between the different between the camcorders. You'll see the difference with the optical stabilizer of the Panasonic is a little bit more floaty. Um, the Sony, I like the way the Sony holds it in place, but the small vibrations are terrible on the Sony. And the Allure 100, um, it is what it is. It's a digital stabilizer, which is nowhere near as floaty. Uh, the Sony shows the most detail, probably the Canon Allure, because there's fewer pixels, shows more detail than the Panasonic. But the Panasonic, with just a press of a button, no fishing your way through a menu, the press of a button can boost the gain. And uh, it, it um, gives it a little advantage over the Sony in regular mode Sony. Now here's the gain boost on the Panasonic versus the night shot uh, on the Sony and the night shot on the so Sony does show more detail but you can see there that flashing that's my finger over the uh, illuminator and that can also happen if your camera's too close to the glass on your car so that's a one thing to watch for when filming with the Sony now you see here I turned the Panasonic to it's night mode which is slow shutter speed mode and it just blows everything away I could not find a slower shutter speed on the Sony um, but this is with the low light mode now if you zoom well out it's very blurry and looks staccato ish um, but so, so if you're zoomed out have it on a tripod or beanbag um, below 10x is fine for hand holding so folks this is uh, one of the reasons why I really like the uh, the Panasonic is you have uh, two different versions of the low light mode I, I didn't even try doing the gain on top of the low light mode uh, I'm just wondering that would probably uh, um, see an absolute complete darkness one well, and this here is very very low light um, testing so that's why I uh, chose the Panasonic as the uh, camcorder of the year for 2010 could change and I know there's a new Pan Panasonic out have not tested it and but I will uh, do a review of the new one shortly but um, just looking at the features I don't think uh, it's going to match up to the TM55 or the SD60 Panasonic those seem to have it all